Bain. I am a fourth year finance student and I am running to be the next DCU Student Union President. Hey guys, my name is Sarah Sweeney. I'm running to be your next DCU SU President. Um, I'm from Fallon in County Donegal and I'm a 21 year old final, final year business study student. My name is Ricardo and I'm running for President for the Student Union. Hey, my name is James Rooney and I'm running for the Presidency in the upcoming DCU election. So my name is Emer McGuire, I'm the current Vice President for Engagement and Development. I am a graduate of St. Pat's College and I'm running for President. I'm running for presidency because after this year I feel like I have so much more to give and I have an invested interest in the student movement and I feel like I know where we've gone wrong this year and how we can improve for next year. So, um, yeah. I'm running because I think I've got some great ideas, some different ideas. Uh, you can check them all out on my podcast, so it should be up on Facebook next week for like our campaign and reason. So um, I think I can bring a fresh approach to the issue. Some of the other candidates, fair enough, have been on the issue but I think that I have a fresh approach that the SU need. My reason to run for the presidency as stated in my manifesto is as a protest candidacy. So my aim is to bring new, new air to the student union so things can get done better. So over the last four years I've gained a lot of, I suppose, experience of what the big problems are in the ECU. I think one of the biggest ones at the moment is the cooperation and students not being happy. I know that the way it's going to go forward will really affect the future of DCU. I think the next two years are going to be crucial. I'm running for the presidency because I want to make a difference. I want to bring some changes and some improvements and also build on some of the success that the current SU has had in the upcoming year. Hidden talents. Well, I did join the summer. I rode bareback up on a mule up into the middle of. 15 miles into the outback to cut down trees for one of my jobs in the state, so that was a bit of a hidden talent, I suppose. <laughs> hidden talents? Jeez, that's a tough one. Um, I suppose one of my hidden talents is that I consistently fail to prepare for exercise and big um, activity events. So recently I've started doing triathlons without having done any exercise or any training for them. So I've gotten through them and it's good that I've done three, three triathlons now but I've nearly had three heart attacks. So I think that's a talent for myself. I can put my foot in my mouth. Literally. Go! I can't believe these things over there. Okay, well I lean against the door. Oh! I've got one really, really special one. I've actually double jointed. <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you I can speak Spanish. Do you want to give uh, an example? Just say something. Hola, Spanish. Español. Et je peux parler aussi un peu de français. And I speak a little bit of English. Et vous parlez de mes catalans.